7-Eleven wanted to promote National Coffee Day by engaging their close to a million Facebook fans online through some sort of fun event that promoted drinking coffee and promoted the holiday itself. A week before the event, they're going to invite their million Facebook fans to vote on who the three most annoying personalities are. Personalities like the ex-boyfriend, the horrible boss, the annoying Bluetooth cell phone guy. Once those three are selected, they're going to have those personalities get dunked in a live dunk tank through a Facebook application that we're creating. The way that they're going to get dunked is by controlling a remote-controlled robotic pitching machine. They're still recovering, I don't know. I would close this whole thing. Basically, have a net tube that runs without In a nutshell, it's a computer that's connected to an Arduino, which in turn is connected to a motor controller, a couple of relays, some switches in order to turn things on and off. All of that going directly to the actuators that make the pitching machine move up and down, and then the pitching machine controls that make it fire, tell it when to fire, tell it what speed to be. Basically, you log in through the Facebook site, uh, you get in line. Once you're in line, you're being controlled by a Java socket server. Uh, that puts you in a queue. As each person goes through the queue and plays the game, it pulls the next person in. It's critical to make that experience as unique as possible, as interesting as possible, and as real time as possible, so that you know the, the hour that they waited in line, the two hours that they waited in line, the three, four hours they waited in line are worth it. So in a rented box truck, we left bright and early Monday morning and fought our way through the hills of Pennsylvania at uh, 30 miles an hour uphill and 100 miles an hour downhill until we made it to D.C. Unpacked the pitching machine, which made it no problem, and started running the video feeds for the live streaming, the on-site server, so that people through Facebook could connect to it. And people were interested, they were there and ready and waiting and everybody on Facebook was really into it. The people on site were just blown away. Um, they couldn't believe that people all over the world through Facebook were controlling this robot and sending these actors over top of the dunking booth to uh, wet, drippy demise. So it was pretty fun.